Welcome to this video on how to export a uh, route to a Garmin device. My name is Koen Meijering and I'm customer support at my route app. Let's begin. So first we're going to select the route. I'm going to select the test routes uh, and I'm going to select the test route Garmin since we're going to uh, export a route to a Garmin. Here you have the route. Uh, obviously I made it in the here map since um, we're going to uh, transport it to a Garmin device. Um, oh, that's not right. Before you want to press export, you have to make sure that your uh, Garmin device is connected to your computer via a USB cable. Um, and if you made sure of that, you can press export. Okay. Then you get this pop up screen. Um, it will show you more about our connector. If you have installed it, um, that's all right. If you haven't, you should install it since it is necessary for uh, the installation or the importation of your um, your routes. Okay, so let's press open route and you get this screen that will ask you to select your device. There are of course several devices, TomTom, Garmin, Interphone, BMW, and I'm going to select Garmin New since I am uh, going to export a route to a Garmin Zumo 595, one of the newer Garmin models. Okay, so once we did that, we're gonna press export and now it will tell you that your route is exported to your device. Now you have to disconnect your Garmin from your computer and you will have to follow the next steps. Um, of course we're gonna import uh, the route so we're gonna press yes here and there you're gonna select it and then press import right there. Okay now it has been imported um, before you want to navigate the route, you have to go to apps and to tracks. There you'll see our track test route. Okay, so we're gonna open it. And there you'll see it. Of course, first we have to, you have to press that icon. There you'll see, there you have to uh, uh, select show on map and you can convert it to trip. Here we're going to select start to finish, so that's easier. Um, here you can rename the route. Um, I'm not going to do that for now, so I'm just going to press done. And it's going to calculate the trip. Um, it's very important for me to say that when uh, you want to stop at multiple places during your route, um, you have to make different you have to make several different routes since you cannot let the Garmin device tell you uh, that you have to stop at a certain waypoint. So if you want to do that, you have to make several different routes. Um, here we're going to press OK, so it has been saved to our trip planner. We're going to go back to the menu, back again, back. And first we have to go to settings. Since there's another very important thing you have to do first, you have to go to navigation and you have to make sure that recalculation is off. So you have to turn it off. I already had that. Um, then you have to save it and you can go back. There you go. Now you have to go to apps. Um, and today we're not, or now we're gonna, not gonna select tracks. Now we're going to select Trip Planner right there. And there you'll see our track and a route. Uh, we're going to use the track since, that more, since that's more accurate than the route. Okay, let's select it. Okay. And here we're going to press Go. We're going to start at the beginning. It's probably the most useful. And we're going to press OK. It's going to calculate. And here you'll see the route. Okay, we're gonna press start. And uh, I don't have, do not have a GPS connection, so I'm gonna simulate driving this route. Um, but if you are outside, um, the route will just start when you start driving. Yes. All right, that's it. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you'll enjoy using my route app.